This YouTube thing I do, right, I don't really have a manager. I don't really have one because I don't have one. I just do it myself and sometimes brands reach out to me that are like smaller brands or just like people who don't really want to do like a full video. Those companies, I just end up telling them like, oh, just like send me pure packages. If I like it, like I'll put it in a vlog or something like that. So I just like I have a lot of packages that build up. And today I thought it'd be fun if we just sat here and opened shit together. This is from Lavi Dog. Is this fun for you guys? Golden turmeric oatmeal latte with hemp extract. This is Enjoy Chilled, so I feel like I should put this in the fridge before I try it. This is from Anna. I specifically told my landlord not to do construction right now. Anna Luisa. I'm wearing one of their rings right now, as you know. They have my heart. Only one of the rings like got scraped up and like scratched and like the coating has come off. But like this one, perfect. I love this one. I'll link everything below. Their whole thing is affordable jewelry, so like $40 and up. Nice for like the aesthetic that they have. I feel like they have very expensive aesthetic. <gasps> they changed their packaging. Sorry, I get so excited about jewelry. <gasps> yes, 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 yes. So I got this beautiful little necklace with a green gem. As you know, I'm very into green lately. Don't know why. This feels really light compared to most of their jewelry. I feel like they're usually heavier, thicker, I want to say. Better quality, one might say. Yeah, but you know what? It's all forgiven because it's cute. It's cute as f Oh, okay, not with the shirt, but like a good layering piece. I wear a lot of plain tank tops, especially during the summer. So this will be so nice for summer. Okay, I've been waiting for these earrings. It's just like a rhinestone studded earring. The thing about having so many earring like piercings is I never know where I'm going to want to put it. Right now it's just there, just so I can show you. But, oh, beautiful. I forgot I got this and I'm so glad I did. Another green piece, another thick ring. I got a four because usually I get like fives and stuff and they don't fit on my fingers. But I think this might be maybe even the slightest bit too tight. But that looks beautiful amazing sorry okay now i match <laughs> we'll be wearing this ring a lot especially i think that might be my favorite piece like get yourself this ring if it fit on my pinky could you imagine i look like a literal pimp my discount code is the same as it always has been i'll leave it in the description it's just pretending at 10. next i have packages from pepper mayo their clothing brand which i've actually seen on instagram i've never shopped on before so i have no idea what i'm in for oh I don't know about this one guys. The color is mango shimmer, which indeed it does shimmer. But I also got it in a size zero because I usually have a really rough time with sizing. I should have gotten it too. Get your actual size. I also thought this was like a loose. I thought this was a looser dress, so I was like, oh, I should get a size smaller and I'd be good. It actually hugs your figure quite nice without hugging your figure. Actually really nice, like I like that. But I don't like the material, it's fucking itchy. I could not imagine wearing this for a long time. Just the first piece that I'm trying on, so I don't wanna rule them out. But I'm definitely selling this because it's just a little too tight for me. To get that dress off, I thought I had to cut myself out of it. My roommate said, don't do that. Specifically said, just suck it in real tight. Anyway, I got out of it, but I had to do like a sh shimmy shoulder like or it was i was sweating this is the next few pieces i love this bucket hat it's like a terry kind of feel i really wanted a bucket hat so i'm glad that i put this in the order because it's summertime and it's hot and this top it's a knit thing and it's um not really stretchy but it just looks so expensive doesn't it also really weird that like you can't really see through it because it's just like a crochet it has like this detail up here which is so unique i think it's super cute damn i like this taking off the tag i also have a discount code for them i think i will be wearing this a lot this summer i already know and so the green trend continues this one is very thin but i feel like that's nice for summer because it's gonna be so hot here it's open back but there's like a tie at the top that isn't connected to this it's like a string that goes through it and so i did lose the end of it and i had to thread it back through which was not that fun for me cute little summer piece you know okay so the tank tops are yes i have one more dress chocolate linen dress I really like the material of this. It just is nice. It's not like tight, but like slinky material that just rides up. Because I feel like it kind of also makes me look like a mom going to like a PTA meeting. I think it might be the cut slash length. I like this part. Actually, it is nice. It's just, I think it's the bottom part. I think I need it to be here. And then it's here. Maybe another PTA meeting because I think that'd be too distracting for the educational system. If you're tall, definitely get this. Or if you like longer dresses in general. I'm definitely keeping this because I feel like this is a good like work function type of dress. Where I also kind of want to look nice at. By nice I mean like 
nice. Now we have some glasses. These are from Glasses USA. Prescription glasses and sunglasses at like 70% of the retail price. You can shop all of this at home because they're online and they're affordable. So like hopefully these look good. A complete pair of sunglasses or eyeglasses starts at only like $30 on this website, which is insane like that's better than walmart also they sponsored this part of the video and you can add your prescription to like any type of frame including sunglasses which i don't do because i wear contacts mostly when i go out so i just got regular sunglasses but i'm really excited because i added blue light to these and these are also my prescription which is why they're so fucking thick because i am blind and they can handle like any type of lens you have if it's like bifocal i don't know the other stuff that like older eyes need that i hope that i don't need anytime soon free shippings and returns i think it might be only for us and canada but they also have a one year warranty i just realized i have my contacts on right now but these are the autoto minimalist frames i really wanted to get frameless glasses I'm gonna try not to open my eyes because that's bad for you. I can't see shit, but I think that this could look good. You tell me. Here's pair number one. And then I decided to get these because they were in the low nose bridge section, which I have really hard time finding glasses that fit me if they're plastic frame because I have like no nose bridge. If you look at that, y'all, there's no nose bridge there. They slip right down. I look stupid. Oh, why can't I see right now? Um. I don't know these no so these are ones that i would send back you can send them back within 14 days and get your like full refund <laughs> bitch are you dumb stupid or dumb these are called the emily e chardonnay and the ones in the low bridge fit categories were emily e paula and some other names so i think i just got the wrong one <laughs> that's fine because i got these versace sunglasses that are part of the low bridge fit and they yeah and they fit so their low bridge fit category is amazing yeah wow this is nice honestly it fits really well so these are the ones that i got that were the wrong ones but anyway you have like a try on option and like these i feel like are always so inaccurate but you can upload your own photo they also have like a sustainable collection like sea glass collection like eco-friendly collection that's just that when i looked on them i don't think there were many for like a low bridge fit people slash i didn't like the styles okay i got thirsty so i retrieved the drinks from the fridge and i'm trying the lavender oat milk one first fuck i just bent this thing and it still isn't open like what is happening I'll try the other one that's how it's supposed to work this is the turmeric one. Oh my god that actually tastes good i was thinking it would taste really bad Oh yeah, there's hemp extract in this. I'm like chugging this because I'm so thirsty. I only have three flavors. So like there's this one, the um, lavender one, and a matcha one, which I don't really like matcha that much. I mean, I like matcha. Honestly, I, I don't eat anything. But they have 15 milligrams of CBD from hemp. Okay, I guess I'll just keep the other one for later. I'm sure it tastes just as good. Not a lot of CBD products, you can actually taste it, but you can't with this one. So next, do we want to do more clothes? Okay, we have like the tiktok leggings this is an example of one of the brands that just kind of sends me random shit but like i'm not gonna do a full video on your leggings you know what i mean but like if i like it i'm gonna wear it stuff so this probably will show up in like a gym video not the tiktok leggings okay i'm gonna try it <laughs> oh my god i can't i can't right now i can't i can't from the front it's not horrible i got a small by the way but why does it make my butt look like, like what is happening here? This is, if anything is detracting from the, I don't feel good. I don't feel good right now. Maybe it's just because it's too loose. But I think this is the smallest size that they have, so I'm going to give it to my friend. I do have an orange pair, but do I even want to do that right now? It's also small. It's, you know what? For the meme. Okay, these ones are tighter. This is better. Honestly, it doesn't look that bad now. I feel like it's the color. I don't feel comfortable with that much amount of scrunch, but some people might. Just a few words on this. Definitely is the TikTok legging look. I don't know if this is the exact same one. They're a little bit long for me and not really the tightest for a small. So I'll just keep that in mind. This is from Jules K. They do handbags. I don't think I like this that much, but I did really want a black purse. And so I was like, let me not go with a basic black purse. 
Let me go with a little diamond shape one, which is really just a square turned to the side. I mean, I would, I'd still wear it. It's not bad. It's just like nothing amazing. This chain though, I feel like my hair's gonna get caught on it. It's one of those like snake chain things. And when I was little, I had one of those necklaces. It has a little compartment in the back. So you can put like your keys and stuff so you don't scratch things. And I feel like this is vegan leather. Wow, I was correct. Just by the feel, I knew. Anyway, this is vegan leather. I really don't know what that- Oh, it also says back here that it's vegan. I'm still a genius, okay. One of these crossbodies, but they have like a pull tie which i think is really cute it's a tiny little bag but i'm for it probably only put your keys and wallet in here maybe not even your phone but i love okay it, they're vegan leather so soft like what is it made out of i don't know but yeah i like this purse this is a cute little one and then i got some tote this is massive so this is like a massive purse which I kind of like. It's kind of weird. Super functional, but also when would I ever wear a purse this big if it wasn't for pictures? I feel a little bit weird. It looks nice. Can't put my fingers. Ooh, it's woven. And on the inside, they have like longer straps in case you want to make it longer. It's super padded. I feel like this is what I would carry my laptop. Mm, I don't think my laptop can fit in here. Nope. But very padded. I would feel like everything in here has a lot of cushion okay and then i got this tote for like the beach specifically for the beach because if i take my regular tote to the beach it just gets filled with sand and then i get annoyed they also have a longer handle who would carry it like i'm sorry don't mean to make fun of the mailman but the zip compartment in the back of it so you can put stuff in there. And there's like two little pocket things in here. It's just a regular tip. No closure. So it's just like open. But I think it's cute. And I'll definitely wear this one. I think this one I might wear more than the other bags. Okay. If you watch my vlog on Friday, you know what this is. But if not, then surprise. This is from Aveline. They asked me if I wanted to do collab with them. But they're a wine company. And I was like, no, I'm not 21. But they still sent me it anyway. I think they had like a glitch in their system or something because it was like a format to fill out. This is maybe Cameron Diaz and Catherine Power. I don't know who that is. But Cameron Diaz. Um, this is a beautiful rosé. I hate rosé. But, I mean, I don't drink. Okay, that was bad. Vegan friendly, free from added sugar, artificial colors, concentrates. Tastes light and fresh with notes of melon and zest. The warmth of the sun and the company of your best friend. This is cute. And that marks the end of today's PR unboxing haul. Editing the video now. And I think I actually like these way better than the rimless ones just because I think it looks really nice on me. I just need to exchange it for a pair that is higher nose fit. Make sure you check out their glasses. I'll link them below. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed everything that you saw today. It definitely was a fun experience for me. And I hope that I can make another one in the future. If you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. And I will see you in a later video.